you know, when you see the, the sign coming into town and, you know, welcome Cremont, 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 the friendly town, that's easy. Got that. Puts me in the right frame of mind. Like to me, a story structure, a good story structure is actually like clockwork. And uh, everything must be, must be able to achieve kind of a precision. So I was um, Zooming with my parents and they were like, you know, how you doing? How's, how's it going? And I was like, fine, you know? And um, I stopped at uh, the hardware store and uh, a fellow named Walter there showed me this thing that this plumbing flange that when you wiggle it, it sounds like a turkey. Anyhow, he said Kremant. Second thing I want you guys to think about is the texture of the story. Rehearsals are a little bit challenging, but, uh, you know, I still totally trust Neil and I'm sure everything's going to work out just fine. Any old Wednesday from the friendly town of Cremant. Yes, ma'am. The outreach committee meeting went very well. We did talk about Any Old Wednesday and their YouTube channel and them somehow representing the festival on their channel, which I'm really confused about. Yeah, then about a half an hour later, my sister, um, my sister Kirsten called and she was like, maybe I would come to Cremont for a, a weekend. It's the channel that puts the peak into the midweek. So, uh, fast forward, her flight got canceled. Um, yeah, twice. So she wasn't able to make it. Sitting here about to grade papers since I'm not in Cremont with you. Why do we create stories? Hmm. Well, thank you for asking me and for giving me this assignment. I think it went pretty well. I'm not all that up to speed with the technical side of the interweb. Mom asked me to ask you, she received some video from Glenn. You know, speaking of the past, I, I wonder if Monique remembers that, that Christmas. They want to tell the story to understand their own conundrum. It was odd that, that that her family should be brought around. I, I, you know, Monique's an only child, and I'm the youngest of fourteen. When I, when we read a story, when we hear a story, when we watch a story, um, how do we make sense of the of the story? Monique and I went into the kitchen, and I stole a couple of uh, yeast rolls that uh, that my mom had just baked. If you are a little bit lost here, it's totally fine. We went into the sewing room and opened the cupboard and there was a full length mirror. And Where was I? Uh, characters. Uh... We both stood at this mirror just eating these yeast rolls, knowing that uh, we were sneaking them. And some people just appear in your life uh, for no reason and they come and they and they go. The Red and White is a, is a well-stocked uh, grocery store. I found everything I need and uh, there's a really nice woman named Betty who was uh, bagging my stuff and, and then she insisted even on carrying it outside and I thought maybe she could uh, give me one of the pronunciations and uh, so I, I asked Betty, where am I? And she said, you're, you're in the parking lot. Um, and I said, no, what's the name of the town? And she said, Kremen. And uh, that, you know, that's we got the groceries in the car and I, I thought I'd try, well, who am I? Uh, and she said, I don't know. All these clues, all these characters and what they have done in a story, whether they can add up towards something. Who do you summon when you, when you say, who am I? Uh, looking in the mirror, eating our stolen yeast rolls. You know, it's hard in a meeting to always I don't think things get done very well in meetings. You have to go away from the meeting to understand what really happened. Huh. Um. My take on what happened in the outreach meeting was that there is some concern. I'm just not really sure how any old Wednesday with their small number of subscribers to the YouTube channel can help us out. We got so used to, you know, watching a story and, and getting a meaning out of, uh, out of the story, but in our real life. The Christmas memory was like so sweet and so lovely. Um, I don't remember it at all. Uh, so not really sure that actually happened, but. Um, you know, we, uh, oh, we met this person and this person must be 
you know, here to either teach me something or uh, to, you know, to give me something. There's lots to choose from, you know, but uh, I think any old Wednesday is, 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 is the banner that we're marching under. I think it just enriches the soup. Yeah, and who knows, you know, speaking of Christmas, um, hopefully I'll see my family then. You'll probably have book club with Gran uh, Wednesday, so. We can return to the any old Wednesday question later. Because otherwise. <laughs> We're hanging on to each other. I'm I'm hanging on to Walter. I'm listening to how Betty pronounces Cremant. Okay, that's, that's actually a balance because we introduce a new character at the beginning who never comes back. Then we introduce another, the other new character. And imagine people could be punching from one web page to another. How exciting is that? I don't know. I, I think, I, you know, I think people are making problems where there aren't any. Wondering if there's anyone out there who actually gets you, you know? Um, Tales of Crement, Crement, its people and its environs. Not gonna take up too much of your time. Miss you, love you, and uh, we'll make the trip happen sometime. Mm -hmm. Thank you.